Hello, I'm Greg McQuaid. Here are the top stories we are following for you today on CBS 6. Chesterfield County Police are investigating a deadly single vehicle crash. It happened just after midnight on Brander Mill Parkway near Barn Spring Road. Police say the car left the roadway and hit a tree. One passenger was pronounced dead at the scene. Police say other occupants of the car were taken into the hospital with serious but non life threatening injuries. Police are not yet releasing the victim's identification. For the 10th year in a row, law firm Allen & Allen is offering a safe way to ring in the new year with its Sober Ride Home program. The firm will cover the fare for up to $25 from participating bars in the city. You can find a code for a ride at the Jasper, Bingo Beer Company, Busky Cider and Slingshot in Richmond. Rides are also available from Dairy Market in Charlottesville. Each code is unique and can be only used once from 11 p.m. on New Year's Eve until 6 a.m. New Year's Day. Mike, hard to believe we're wrapping up 2023. Right, Greg. In fact, we had the wettest December on record. We're just shy of nine inches of rain for the month, but it's going to be dry for this weekend. We'll have highs in the 40s to low 50s across the area today. Tonight, we we'll drop down the 20s to around 30 degrees away from the coast. For tomorrow, high temperatures will make it up into the low 50s. A few 40s like near the coast and up in the mountains and going into New Year's Day, we are going to have temperatures in the upper 40s to around 50. Midnight hour for Sunday night, about 38 degrees, a few scattered clouds. And then on New Year's Day, you're looking for a high temperature of 49 degrees. If you have any travel plans across the region, not much going on here locally, but there will be some snow showers for the next couple days in the Panhandle and also in the state of West Virginia. Tomorrow is going to be a mostly sunny day. And then going into New Year's Day, we'll have the chance of a couple of sprinkles and more snow showers will form out in West Virginia where they will see some accumulating snow.